like flow to me is one of the most joyous states of life. I, I'll never forget when I read the book and I was like, oh my gosh, that like, that's why I like sports. It's this zone to your point. It's the counterbalance to the easy bake oven world. Um, but, and you talk about this, getting into those states often takes a prolonged period of time and focused attention. And that is where the struggle lies, yeah. right? Tell us about uh, how, what the research shows about how long it takes to, to task switch and how we can get better at getting into these more focused states. Yeah. So, so focused attention is, is a precursor to flow, right? You, you need to begin by being focused on something. But I, I actually want to back up a bit and I yeah. want to uh, talk about a misconception that people have about flow. Uh, so first of all, flow does involve some kind of challenge of, of your skill, right? You, mm. you have to use your skill in some way. Um, I, I used to be an artist and I used to get into flow quite, quite often. Um, it, I, I was challenged at just the right level. If you're playing sports, you're challenged. If something is too hard, let's say you're just learning, uh, you're just learning how to ski. You're not going to be in flow because you're doing something that you haven't mastered the skill yet for. Mm. But if you've got the, the skill for it and you've reached that optimal level, then you can get into a flow state. Watching Netflix is, is not a flow state, right? Uh, playing, playing TikTok or mm. surfing the Internet is not being in a flow state. Uh, because there's there's no challenge or or skill involved in it, and there's a, a misconception that for knowledge workers, you know, this is the kind of work that we've been studying quite a bit. You you can be a financial analyst, you can be a lawyer, you could be uh, working in the tech industry. Um, the nature of the work is not conducive to flow. Uh, if you're a complex coder, you know, you're writing very complex code. Yes, you could probably get into flow. If you're playing a video game, you know, an action video game, yes, you can probably get into flow. But for most of the day-to-day -day work that people do, it involves focus, but not necessarily flow. Mm -hmm. And I would say if you want to get into flow, then pick up sports or pick up a hobby that where you can gain a skill and be passionate about it. Right. There are a lot of ways to get into flow, but it's, you know, it's, it's kind of hard uh, to do it on our devices and let's say you compose music or, right. or do art. Yeah. Funny enough, when I think of flow in front of any screen, the, the few times aside from gaming, which I think I've experienced it, which is odd is um, like really, complex spreadsheet work 